What is going on guys, Burning Spirit Fire, bringing you some Pokemon Black 2. So last time we got our Pokemon, got our Pokedex. This time we are going to see what Bianca's doing, because she wants to show us some, something to do with catching Pokemon or something. Uh, also, I'd like to apologize, last video, the like the videos itself was sort of like uh, uh, pixelated type stuff, like some of the characters, because, uh, you know, it was more, it was zoomed in or something like that. So it's all, it should be all good now, it should be a lot better, a lot better anyway. Um, I don't know if it's like great, like better, but it's definitely uh, definitely a lot better than what it was. So you know, that's cool. Hopefully, it's good now. But again, the audio is um, the audio. It's more of how to listen to it. It's more the audio is slower than uh, normal. Like the game itself, like the in-game, the characters and all that stuff. Far, it's like normal pace, but the uh, audio itself is slower. Um, I've tried to fix that. I don't know how to fix it. If you know how. Uh, let me know. Just leave me a comment. Give me a personal message. Just let me know how, if I can fix the audio in any way to make it like you know proper speed. But yeah, the audio is like a tad slower, and so sometimes it speeds up, sometimes it gets slower. But um, the, like the actual game itself is actually basically the same speed. But uh, again, I apologize for the audio. But um, I was gonna do you know off a camera, and it would have been worse altogether. Like you would have got better audio but you would have got worse video quality. So I think video quality is a tad better than the audio. So hopefully, you know, hopefully it's good. Because I am giving you a voice. If I was just giving you the audio in the game, which I've seen people do, then yeah, it would suck. But since I'm giving you a voice as well, should make it better, hopefully. I mean, hopefully. But uh, anyway, she's going to catch a Purloin. Level 2. Nice. Very good. And I have to say, I hate the Pokemon, like the Pokeball animation, like it's so slow, like I remember playing uh, Pokemon Black and I was trying to catch, uh, what is it, um, I can't remember, one of the legendaries, not Kiram, not, not, not one of the two dragons, Some, something, Thunderous maybe, um, yeah, it took so long and the Pokeball animation was even slower because I didn't use my Master Ball, I was catching it like, properly. I think it was Thunderous. If that's the roaming Pokemon, then yeah, and then Thunderous. If that, yeah, I think it's Thunderous. But anyway, the point is, Pokeball animation very slow, especially when you're catching legendaries because it takes a lot longer than what it used to. That's just a little complaint I have, but that's okay. All right, so let's check out the wild Pokemon in this place. If I can find one, come on, wild Pokemon. All right, so we have a Purloin. Actually, I think Purloin and Patrat is what we can find here. Not great. But, if you want to add it to your team, I recommend it, I guess. It's definitely better. But, uh, you know, Purloin's not too bad. It's pretty much like Poochyena and stuff. Like, Pokemon you can use, like, it's not like they're not, it's not like they're bad like, in your team. They're just not great. So you're definitely able to use them, just they're not good. Like, great, compared to others. Especially in this game. This game, they give you a lot of good Pokemon to choose from, and I just mean a lot. There's just... So many Pokemon, like, so many, just crap ton of Pokemon to choose from, um, when Black sort of gave you a limit, so Perlone probably did work in Black and White, the originals, but, uh, yeah, this game, I don't think you'll want to use them, because there's so many good Pokemon. Anyway, we're going to get this item, and it is a potion, a p -p -p potion always nice. Um, you there, trainer! My name is Oda. I'm a trainer with a keen interest in the world. One of my goals is to tell people about how wonderful it is to walk towards the future together with Pokemon. And you are... Hmm, so you're Zero. From... I don't even know how that pronounces... Well, that, how that city's pronounced. Aspertia? Aspertia? Aspertia Town. We'll, we'll go with that. And he's just... He's checking me out. I mean, I work out. I work out. Uh, indeed, I'll train you a little. Follow me! Alright, buddy. With your crazy, crazy hair. It's like raining in here. What the crap? I do not remember that. It's, I don't know. Maybe it's always been raining here. I don't remember. Uh, yeah. I'm sort of reading the text as I go, because I have not seen the English text before. So, yeah. Um. Yeah. Let's talk to these people. Let's check check out what's going on. Uh, yeah, sure. Me too! Yeah! Uh, people always think the past or future would be so wonderful, but the great time we're spending with Pokemon is right now. Those words, buddy. 
true meaningful words. Hits me. Hits me deep down inside. Hits me deep down inside. In the morning, my Pokemon come to wake me up when they're hungry. At night, my Pokemon get tired from playing. Take up the whole bed. Huh. Man, could you imagine having a Snorlax living with you and you, like, let it sleep in, uh, your bed? Like, it takes up the whole bed. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. I, actually, I think it'd be bigger than the house, too. Uh, anyway. This shall be where we start training. By the way, why are you holding two town maps? Whoa! Oh, really? Actually, he pretty much said that. He's like, oh ho! <laughs> Funny. It's your friend's town map, is it? Your friend is one with the Tepig. <laughs> He's one with the Tepig. Wish I was one with the Tepig. So apparently we have to go do this, and yeah, then we can go get that awesome training from Elder. You're gonna want that training from Elder. After all, he is a future, or past champion, I should say. I guess he just... I don't know, did he ever get his crown back? I mean, are we counting the after game in Pokemon Black? Like, are we counting the after game? Or is it just like, my character, or the character you were in Black, Pokemon White and Black won and then lost to the champion in this game? I'm not gonna spoil it, but... Um, is that what happened? I don't know. Maybe. Did Elder ever get this crown back? Are we just ignoring the after game? I don't even know. I don't even know. Uh, speaking of the after, or the, uh, the original games, um, if you have the your DS copy and you have two DSs, you can actually do like a memory link type thing. Uh, it'll be in the, the starting menu. And uh, it's actually pretty cool. If you do it, you can actually... Um, uh, how do I explain it? Basically, at certain points of the game, um, when you talk to certain people, you get like a past memory type thing. And what it will do is it will go back to basically where the first games took place, and it will show certain things. For an example, uh, around this point of the game, uh, you'll talk to someone, and he'll it'll go back in time, and it will see N releasing his Pokemon into Charged Stone Cave, um, and he's talking about he's gonna battle um, the original main character from One Black, and all that battle, and he's gonna do all this stuff, and he's talking about his plan. So. Basically, they go over what N's thinking and I guess other stuff, so that's pretty cool. Like, they actually give you an insight of what N is, and yeah, like, N's a mystery. And this game sort of unravels him and shows you what he's been thinking and stuff, which I think is really cool. That's like, really, it's really cool. Um, yeah. So, like, this definitely is a good sequel. I mean, from what I've seen, what I've played the Japanese ones, but I guess even like the, uh, like, the fact that they have that in the games, like, it's a good sequel, I have to say. It really is a sequel to the game. But, uh, anyway. Here's a Vine Whip. And that does about a quarter. I wonder if Tackle does more. I should find out. I should find out. Uh, also, probably interesting to mention that the three starters in this game got reanimations, and by that I mean they do different animations. Like, Snivy used to cross his arms, now he doesn't. He, like, puts his arms back. Which is worse, in my opinion. I mean, it shows less effort. Like, he looked cooler when he crossed his arms. He was like, I'm a badass. I'm a badass snake crossing my arms. What you got? What you got? Well, you got nothing on me. I'm a snake. But now he's just like, puts his arms on his back and stuff. Uh, I don't know if Oshawa's changed, because Oshawa used to take a, or its uh, thing off its stomach, so I hope they didn't change that, because that was cool. Um, anyway. Here we get a Paralyze Heal. Gotta get me some of that paralyzed heal. Oh, he's another trainer. Uh, feel this boiling spirit, my pat rider is gonna amaze you. I seriously doubt it. I seriously doubt it. And yeah, also every trainer in this game has an animation, which would have put a lot of effort in their part, but looked so cool. Just little things make the game so good. And I just have to say, when they ever remake third gen games, like Ruby, Sapphire, or Emerald, if they ever remake them, which I hope they do, I hope to God, or I hope to Arceus that they do, um, the games are going to be so good, I mean, they'll have to reanimate, because we've only seen, like, fifth gen, how all, all of it's changed, we've only seen this style of fifth, like, this style of game, like, how it's styled, where third gen is, like, a different style, so that means they're going to have to re, re like, redo it, that this style, but with the, you know, you know what I'm saying, it's just going to be so good to see it, like, how it is these days, um, in third gen version, it's just going to be so good, so good, uh, but anyway, I'm fully going off random topics here, I mean, this game just came out, and I'm already talking about Ruby and Sapphire remakes, so, I don't know, 
Um, you can't go this way because that guy will block it off, will block you off, so you have to come over here and find Hugh, I think. Um, the Flosset, the Flocacy Ranch, I think that's how it's pronounced, Flo Flocacy, Flo Flocacy, I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm just going to call it the Flocacy for the time being until I, I find out, but anyway. Uh, oh nice, you've came here to toughen up. Alright, let's see how much t there, how much stronger you've become. Come at me! Wow, I was gonna say come at me, bro. Like, uh, you know, but I imagine a lot of people are gonna do it. So I'm like, don't wanna be a part of it, just nope. But yeah, funny, because he actually said come at me. That's cool, it's funny. But he's got a level 8 Tepig, I don't even think my... Well, I guess actually, I think he is. Uh, yeah, so she's also level 8. If you're playing challenge mode, it will be level 9. Throwing that out there. Um, let's go for a Leo. Because I feel like Leo is just going to help me in the long run. Going to help me do some more. I recommend not using your elemental move that you learnt. Because it probably won't do as much as just your basic tackle. Just saying. Um, I feel like I'll be able to survive a tackle anyway. Oh, I use Leo again. God damn it. Um, yeah, I should be able to survive another tackle, and then I'll heal up, and then I shall finish it off. I mean, someone could have at least healed me up. Seriously. What is this? Making me have to waste my own crap to heal up? It's, it's stupid. Very stupid. Uh-huh. Alright, so I got some, I got two potions. It's, it's, that's, that's cool. That's cool. So that's gonna heal up the old snivy snivy. Or spirit, I should say. Another tail wag. You're going crazy with those tail wags. Um, Alright, so now we can go for a tackle. Hopefully it does about half. I mean, two leers. That's like defense struck by like four, so. Not even half. That's stupid. Stupid, very stupid. And after two tail wags, that's how much it does. <laughs> Interesting. And he says, come on, partner. Um, I sort of wish he said, just. I don't know, it would have been, wouldn't have been that hard to write its name, like what Pokemon he has, but I don't know, that's just me nitpicking things. Because again, haven't seen the English text before, so I'm sort of just reading it the first time. But, uh, yeah. Anyway. Uh, da, 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 da. We get to level 9, which is sweet. And yeah, it can't be. How could I have lost? I need to apologize to my partner. Yes, you do. Apologize. Uh, thinking about how strong I should be able to count on you for backup. Uh, town map. Alright, so we gave him the town map. That's cool. Uh huh. So here comes these peoples. I guess the people who own the ranch. Uh, who are you? I love that he's just like, who are you? Who am I? I'm the owner of this ranch, and this is my wife. After a Pokemon battle, we should heal your Pokemon's HP right here. I'll give you this. Uh, anyway. So, I guess she healed us up. Did you actually heal up my Pokemon, or did you just give me a potion? Because if you just gave me a potion, that is rude. I sort of want to be healed up. Uh, you're a little roared. Are you kidding me? That's so good. I love his dialogue. It's like, are you kidding me? It's so good. So good. Uh, why did he get so mad? The guy's got anger issues. You should go check out that anger management. Also watch the show, Anger Management. <laughs> uh, throwing that out there. So did she heal my Pokemon up? She didn't. So take note, she didn't heal your Pokemon up. But I think if you talk to her again, she actually will heal your Pokemon up. Yes, she does. Alright, cool. I don't see why she couldn't just heal them up anyway, but whatever. Alright, so next time, we are going to be checking out the Flossetti. I still don't know how to pronounce that. It's going to kill me that I don't know how to pronounce it. But anyway, that's what we're doing next time. I'm going to check out this good old ranch, see what's going down. And uh, yeah, remember to leave a like, subscribe for more Pokemon Black 2. Going to give you all, all these videos, all this cool stuff. So remember to subscribe. And uh, yeah, later.